Frodo Baggins, the unassuming hobbit from the Shire, embarks on one of the most iconic hero's journeys in literature and film. His quest in The Lord of the Rings to destroy the One Ring, a powerful artifact forged by the Dark Lord Sauron, is a story that resonates on many levels. Not only does Frodo's journey encapsulate the classic elements of the hero's quest, as defined by Joseph Campbell, but it also subverts some of these expectations by exploring the burdens of power, friendship, sacrifice, and the limits of personal strength. As we follow Frodo from the safety of the Shire to the fiery depths of Mount Doom, we witness the evolution of a hero who is not defined by his strength or combat skills, but by his perseverance, moral resolve, and vulnerability. At the start of his journey, Frodo is an ordinary hobbit, living a quiet life in the Shire. He has no desire for adventure, much like his uncle Bilbo, who reluctantly set off on his own journey decades earlier. Frodo's world is peaceful, simple, and isolated from the turmoil of Middle-earth. Yet, it is this very isolation that makes the Shire an ideal place for the One Ring to remain hidden. When Gandalf the Grey, a wizard and friend of Frodo's, discovers the true nature of the ring in Frodo's possession, the hobbit is thrust into a role he never asked for. The fate of the world now rests on his shoulders. This moment is Frodo's call to adventure, a key element in the hero's journey. Despite his fears, Frodo accepts the burden of carrying the ring to Rivendell, marking the beginning of his quest. From Rivendell, Frodo's journey becomes more perilous, as he and the Fellowship set out toward Mordor, the dark land where the ring must be destroyed. Along the way, Frodo faces numerous trials, both external and internal. Externally, he is pursued by the ring wraiths, terrifying servants of Sauron who will stop at nothing to reclaim the ring. Internally, Frodo grapples with the seductive power of the ring, which grows stronger the closer he gets to Mordor. The ring represents ultimate power, and as Gandalf and others warn, even the purest of hearts can be corrupted by it. Frodo's task is not just to carry the ring, but to resist its pull, a feat that becomes increasingly difficult as the journey progresses. One of the most defining aspects of Frodo's hero's quest is his reliance on the help of others. Unlike traditional heroes who often fight their battles alone, Frodo's journey is defined by the friendships he forges along the way. His most steadfast companion is Samwise Gamgee, his loyal gardener and friend. Sam is the embodiment of loyalty and hope, supporting Frodo through the darkest moments of the journey. While Frodo is the ring bearer, Sam carries the emotional weight of the quest, providing strength when Frodo feels he can go no further. Their relationship, grounded in deep friendship and trust, is one of the most poignant aspects of the story. Without Sam, it is likely that Frodo would have failed in his mission. In addition to Sam, the Fellowship includes Aragorn, Legolas, Gimli, Boromir, and Gandalf, all of whom play essential roles in protecting Frodo. Aragorn, the future king of Gondor, serves as a mentor figure, guiding the group through dangerous terrain and offering wisdom when hope seems lost. Boromir, while ultimately succumbing to the temptation of the ring, highlights the inherent danger of power and the consequences of even well-meaning desires for control. His tragic end serves as a reminder to Frodo of what could happen if he himself falls victim to the ring's influence. Throughout the quest, the support of the Fellowship emphasizes that Frodo's journey is not a solitary one. His heroism lies not in his ability to triumph alone, but in his willingness to accept help and rely on the strength of others. As Frodo ventures deeper into Mordor, the physical and psychological toll of carrying the ring becomes unbearable. He becomes more withdrawn, suspicious, and burdened by the weight of his task. The ring exerts an overwhelming influence on him, and even Sam, his closest friend, cannot entirely shield him from its effects. This culmination of Frodo's struggle reveals the darker side of the hero's journey, the realization that some tasks may be too great for any one person to bear. Frodo's strength is not limitless, and his mental and emotional exhaustion highlights the human, or hobbit, vulnerability at the heart of the story. One of the most surprising moments in Frodo's journey occurs when, after all the trials, he stands at the very edge of Mount Doom and is unable to let go of the ring. In a moment of weakness, he claims the ring for himself, demonstrating the insidious power that has been building throughout his journey. This moment subverts the traditional hero's arc, where the protagonist triumphs through sheer willpower. 
Instead, it is Gollum, the corrupted former ring bearer, who ultimately ensures the destruction of the ring, albeit unintentionally. Frodo's failure to destroy the ring shows that even the greatest heroes can falter under the weight of immense responsibility and power. However, this moment of failure does not undermine Frodo's heroism. Rather, it reinforces the central theme of The Lord of the Rings, that no one, not even the most humble or pure-hearted, can face evil alone. It is through the collective effort of the Fellowship, Frodo's unwavering moral compass, and ultimately fate, that the ring is destroyed. Frodo's journey is one of sacrifice. He gives up his home, his peace of mind, and nearly his life to save Middle-earth. In the end, Frodo returns to the Shire, but he is forever changed by the experience. He has borne the weight of evil and survived, but at great personal cost. The hero's journey, as embodied by Frodo Baggins, is one of endurance, friendship, and the struggle against overwhelming odds. While Frodo may not possess the physical prowess or combat skills of other heroes, his strength lies in his heart, his willingness to face fear, and his reliance on the love and support of his companions. Through Frodo, the Lord of the Rings shows that heroism is not defined by grand feats of strength or glory, but by the quiet courage to keep moving forward, even when the burden seems too great.